Welcome to Brick After Brick Toys, Ninjago Builders. We are so excited. Can't wait for the Ninjago movie to come out this fall. And right now we're just starting with a couple of quick sets so you can get the idea of what Lego's putting out there. This is one of the less expensive sets and I think that's great so that it's like under $20. I think it was like, I don't know, 10 or $12. So it's a really reasonably priced set. And you get two but if you stay tuned, kind of three minifigures out of this. So you'll have to see what I mean by that. So um, let's get started. Let's get started building. All right, so let's start with Kai. He looks awesome. So Kai, of course, in his red outfit. Take a look here. Let me take this back off so you can see. That's really, really pretty design. I love that. And he's got like a, um, a place to for his crossbow and for... Um, swords and also for um, he's got a shoulder pad there so he has two faces a happy smiling face kind of and a very intense face so I think uh, I think Kai looks looks awesome in this and I like how the uh, masks are two pieces this time so it's a little bit fussy because you have to um, play around with two pieces but I think it looks really awesome once you put um, the mask together with the um, the headpiece. It looks awesome with that red headband and everything. Looks really great. And of course, he's got to have his katana. So he's ready for fighting. He's ready to go. Okay, let's see. Chop, chop. Yes. Okay, awesome. He is ready to go. And he looks great from front and back. So let's see what Zane is going to look like here. All right, Kai. Enough. Enough, Kai. Enough showing off. Okay, here comes Zane. And of course, Zane is um, also got a really, I love the, um, the outfit. You can kind of see the sparkly silver paint on um, the front and the back. And of course he also has um, his ninja mask. But the thing is, um, Zane in this particular movie, he has a really short haircut. And so they're not even gonna give you a hair piece for him for this one. They're just gonna give you the, ma the, um, the ninja mask. All right, so he looks great. And of course he's got his bow and arrow there. And he is ready to go. He's got arrows on the back. And there we go. All right, these guys look awesome. They look ready to train. They're in a they're really, oh, and you see the little um, the little sign back there that says um, Dojo Wu. So this is Wu's Dojo, Master, Master Wu. All right, and so did you see that little um, figure that we just made to the side, to the left? That's kind of that third mini figure that I was talking about. That's actually really fun. It's like a, um, it's, it's a Garmadon combat dummy. So that is going to be really fun for you to play around with. And it actually wobbles and moves. So that's going to be super fun. Now what we're doing is we're putting together the corner piece, which kind of gives you this really, um, really nice dojo effect. It has, um, has some great windows and a scroll. And on the scroll, you're going to see, we get that scroll together, you're going to see that's where the, um, the sign piece goes. So that is um, for Master Wu's dojo. So, all right. And once we get this together, be sure to stay tuned to the end because I actually put um, this little dojo into more of an official looking setting with some water and grass and things like that. So it, it looks really cool. But this is what you get, and it does have some window pieces. So from the front, it looks awesome. From the back, eh, kind of boring. But it also has, you know, kind of a cute top to it. Gives it that really nice oriental um, flair. And so one more piece. I thought this was really pretty. I like this. This is like a nice red lamp, and red is just such a beautiful color. Um, and it just is a very, very strong color. So it's like a color of happiness. So I think that's just, it looks awesome. Looks really great. Oh, and you can see like a claw and a hammer tool back there. So there's lots of little tools for them to play with and to use as they train and get ready. Make sure that they're ready to go because Garmadon and his shark army, they are coming. So, okay, you guys, <laughs> they are ready to, they're excited. They're ready to train and get things going. All right. So Zane is going to try his bow and arrow there. Yep, looks like it's going to work. All right. And there was just a little bit extra, so I did put together one little extra piece as well. Oh, looks like Kai is going for the claw. Ah, watch out. You've got a claw. That's a really strong-looking claw. That's kind of, kind of dangerous. <laughs> All right. And, of course, I love the, um, the little sword holder um, 
over with you can see the katanas over to the to the side there they look great so this is a really cute little set and there it is there's your Garmadon figure. Garmadon, there are a lot of different Garmadons with the um, Ninjago Leggy, Lego Ninjago movie this year. So you kind of have a Garmadon figure here because it's your basically your combat dummy. So you get to kick Garmadon around a little bit in practice before you see that. So here's the tan base plate. That definitely makes it look better. But here I wanted you to see, um, I have the dojo off in the distance. And this actually is the Master Fall set, which I'm doing a video on as well. So you can uh, stay tuned to our Brick After Brick channel and you can see that video coming up really soon. And I love that one because it almost reminds me of Indiana Jones because it's just so much fun with the, um, with the little river and you know the, um, the bridge crossing and everything. But take a look at that dojo in the back. Doesn't that look awesome? With, oh, and there's the alligator from the um, city jungle set that we um, that we did a few weeks ago. And look, there's the uh, there's the guy carrying the water from uh, from the Master Falls set. He or or from one of the other sets. He's just carrying the water. He doesn't have anything else to do. All right. So this that's what it looks like, and I hope you enjoy. Um, putting this set together, it really is a very fast build, so it's not going to take you long, and it'll be fun. It'll be something fun you can add in with all the other Legos that you have, and uh, have a great time at the movie if you haven't gone yet, and um, just there's lots of great imaginative sets and some cool dragons and everything, so I can't, I, I'm really looking forward to seeing the movie and also making more videos. So thanks for, um, if you would like and subscribe to our channel, that'd be awesome. Thanks so much. Have a great day and lots of fun playing with the Ninjago Lego movie.